There's a new art gallery in central Oahu. It's beautiful. It features artists from Hawaii as well as around the world. Yeah, Chris Lachonic, he's there. He joins us live from Leeward Community College. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, Sam and Chevy, and happy Aloha Monday to everybody. Yes, we're here in a cool new gallery here at Leeward Community College. It's called the Hoike Akea Gallery, and it's just happened. This is the second, actually, ex exhibition that's happening. It's actually called uh, Facing the Future with Art by Past and Present Faculty here. And speaking of one of them, we're speaking with Erica Molino, who's uh, as a lecturer as well as uh, uh, got some art over here. So, Erica, tell me about this great new gallery here at LCC. Yeah, so this is, as you said, our second show. Um, it's brand new. We had some great funding um, and great support from our administration for this. And we're aiming to be just one of the cutting edge galleries here on the island, um, sort of combining culture from here in Hawaii and inviting the rest of the world in too. But we have a world class faculty. Um, we have world class lecturers. And we're looking forward to bringing more on board full time in the future. So should we? Look well, at some art. How about you just tell me, how important is it to have this kind of gallery here at LCC? It's super important. It's, uh, our mission is really educational. So it's, it's not just showing off pretty things that we make. Um, this is actually about showing different perspectives, um, contemporary issues, and the way art can express ideas um, is much different than, say, music or writing and everyone's invited into it you can get your own interpretation based on your background yes and I was been getting it just being here I look at all of these pictures and paintings and artworks I, you see something different you think of something new and the vibrant colors and just it, it, it's so amazing the interpretation that you get from this so tell me also about your art that we have over here on the wall sure yeah so this is a series that I did uh, kind of recently, and my background is in both traditional arts and digital arts. Mm -hmm. Here I teach design and printmaking. Um, so these kind of started out as experiments in design, just playing with elements of art and principles of design. Um, I tinkered around with some shapes in Illustrator, and then I actually just hand cut uh, some cotton fiber papers um, and started manipulating the elements. Um, and then after I did that and I found a composition that was pleasing, I, I burnt the edges and then I constructed them into semi-dimensional forms. Um, so I put some spacers between them. And the interesting thing was the, the process actually informed the meaning of the works. Yeah. So the central piece that you see, that was the first one. And then you'll see one sort of on the lower right that was actually from the cutouts from uh -huh. that piece. Okay, now I can um, see that. When I was reflecting on the materials and the process and how everything was... Um, turning out mm -hmm. the central piece looked a lot like tree rings to me ah. um, so if you look at the names of the pieces they all have these kind of big ephemeral names um, and it's because I was relating human experience my human experience and the materials and the things that these looked like um, the way we personify different elements in mm -hmm. simple ways and how they're interacting uh, to these themes so like with tree rings you think of experience and age right uh, with the act of burning, it's totally transforming things. You think of um, actually beauty through degradation mm -hmm. or, or, you know, I'm from Montana originally, so a lot of times we'll have forest fires and mm -hmm. you can't grow new pine trees until you have a forest fire mm -hmm. that releases the seeds. So it's, it's something um, that I've experienced in my life itself, you know, where you, you walk through fire, you go through difficult times, and then hopefully... If you're someone, you know, of faith or you keep a good perspective on it, you grow from that and you mm -hmm. change and you evolve. And that's amazing. Kind of here in Hawaii, we have the volcanoes. We have Pelican. They uh, have destruction, degradation. And then from that, new birth, new land, new everything. Thank you so much, Erica. It's the whole Ike Akea Gallery right here at Leeward Community College. And you could come see it for free. We'll have all the details on our website at kh12.com. And it's definitely a beautiful place to be and a great place to showcase your art. So make sure you get in touch with them. Uh, you could possibly here in the future. This is Chris Subtronic working for Hawaii right here at KHUN2 News reporting from the new Ho Ho Hoike Akea Gallery right here at LCC. Sending things back to you.